order for you to learn more about PHP, you could build projects. And today I'm going to show you how you can build a color project where we'll be using the switch statement. So this will help us to understand how the switch statement works. We we'll declare a variable favorite color. Now you could add any color, but I'm using blue. You could use any color that you like. So we are assigning the value blue to that variable. Now switch. In parentheses, we add that fav color in the parentheses. Dollar fav color. Then curly braces, we use the case. So switch and case, they are very, very important to note. Now if it's purple, colon, this would be the output. Echo, in quotes, your favorite color is purple. Then we add the semicolon. So we'll add the break statement after that. Now this break statement is very, very important. Without this break statement, the whole cases in the switch statement will just be the output and we do not want that. Now we could add another case. If the case is red, colon, echo, your favorite color is red. Then semicolon and break. So this, we have about two cases in here. We could add three because of that color blue. So we could add blue this time around. Echo, if it's blue, as we have it there. Echo, in quotes, your favorite color is blue. So it's more like the if-else statement, but it's switch and case for this project. Switch case and then the break statement, which is very, very important. Now let's add one more to make it four. In quotes, green, then colon. Echo the output, your favorite color is green. So if it happens that any of these happens to be the case, the output will be there. Then we break the statement. Now if it happens that your color does not happen to be in any of these lines default, which is the else, like in the if else statement, the else default colon echo, your favorite color is none of the above so your favorite color is not purple is not red is not blue is not green so it's none of the above when we save this we we'll first of all break it first remember the break key when it's very very important we'll break it so this is how we build a color project and this is how the switch statement works when we save and refresh you see the color is blue and why it's set to blue is because fave color has been assigned the variable blue. If we change it to green and then save that and refresh, you see it's your favorite color is green. So this is how the switch statement works and this is how we've built a color project.